people, 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 people. Que pasa, sac pase, what they do. Now, this video is about something that I saw on social media and it pertains to the JCF. We are speaking about the JCF and the joint JDF conducting some routine search. And I am not sure if it was in the zones of special operation. However, what happened is that they pulled over a minibus and they was conducting a search. So therefore, they asked all of the people, the passengers in the minibus to come out so they can search them and basically search the van and Rete and Lele. Now, people, you understand that with this channel, I am always seeking truth i am always seeking rights i am always standing up for justice and in this case i did not see the police do anything wrong in this case i saw that the police was very professional as a matter of fact they were being very patient and very professional which is not what we have come to expect or seen from the police lately so therefore whenever we see them do something good we have to applaud them we have to give credit where credit is due however on the other hand i noticed that a lot of these passengers they were very disrespectful they were acting very rude they were acting very barbaric and people like me say with all of the crime that is going on in jamaica it is what the police has to do it is what the security forces has to do just to make sure that they catch people off guard when they least expect it it is called surprise it is called shock and awe so anyways, I am going to let you watch the video and then I am going to give my views and opinion. So take a listen, take a look. You still work, Miss, if you don't know your rights. You are arrest and charge, step off of the vehicle. Go and read the policy. Miss, go and read the policy. If you don't know what you're for, if you don't know the law, go and read the policy. You know what I'm talking about? No. You know what? What do you have in the bag, Miss? What do you have in the bag? Buy a bag, see Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't fall in the position that this young lady is. Cut your cut in. Thank you. I'll plot one other one of my yard. A three police living on my yard. Thank you for your time. My two and whatever. I'm going to go to the house. I'm I wouldn't know, man. Eh? Come here, Lisa. My school is here. You are a school, as you must behave properly. Okay. I'm not going to 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 I'm not Come on, man. Nobody give you anything. Anybody put anything in the bag? Okay. Anybody put anything in the bag? Anybody put anything in the bag? Hello, come here, young lady. Thank you. Anybody put anything in the bag, sir? Okay. 
Anybody give anything to put in your bag? Okay. All right. Can I see your bag, please? Don't. Miss. Miss, step off the box. Miss, oh. let me search. Let me get look at your bag. You ask Miss? a woman to search me. Miss? Girl, bag. Miss, don't assault me. Do not assault me, young lady. Sorry. Sorry. Can't go in my bag, you know. You're supposed to search a woman's bag, you know. Come, come. Miss, don't They that assault themselves shall be a base. An idiot, man. They are idiots. And just for the record, miss. Just no, she has seen. Just for the record, you are being videoed here, yeah, miss. So. And you, you, you have saw me and called me an idiot. I have you on on on, on video. Say an idiot. Have you here? Have everybody else here? No, you don't look good to. to no, I don't need them to be with me. I don't need them. Police are the not idiot. I look at me to that girl. And you come again, you come poor. On a bad mind. And then they empty. On a wicked. I just said, and they empty the bag. I like how you're a police. Bad mind and wicked. John, I'll be looking for me now, miss. Step inside the cell. Come on, I'm done. I'm going to sue you. Yes, I'm done. And she's there. Come. I'm going to pull up the bus and make the bus empty. John, I'll be looking for me now, miss. I'm going to pull up the bus. So go on now. Now you pull it away, idiot. Are you feeling me? Which way you coming for try? Do you want to try? Which being coming for giant? The police vehicle, yeah? Say, lead the way, lead the way, lead the way. I dictate the case now. Lead the way now. Lead the way now. I mean, to lead the way. I want to lead me. Lead the way. 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 Lead Give me back to don't put nothing in there. Give me back. Driver, thank you for your cooperation. You may go. All right, citizens, thank you for your cooperation. You may go. Now, people, when I watched that video, the only problem that I saw around with what the police did is that there was not a female officer there to search the ladies, to check them purse, to pat them down, because like me say, Due to the rules and regulation, that is what is supposed to happen. But under the circumstance, we have to understand. And like me said, desperate times calls for desperate measures. And if we see what is going on in Jamaica lately, we see that there's a lot of crime, there's a lot of violence, a lot of people getting taken out for no reason. So what the police is doing, it is called a zone of special operation. It is called a routine search. So you have to understand, you have to know the law, you have to know the rules, you have to know the regulations. You have to know your rights. And in this circumstance, the police is right because they are just doing their jobs. And people must understand that these police officers don't know them from Adams. 
They don't know if this person or that person is a criminal or a law-abiding citizen. There is no way the police can know. So how is it that you are going to get upset with the police and saying that you're not a criminal and you're not no gun and the police wicked and rate and lele? People, we have to understand, we have to have common sense. We have to be rational because the truth and the fact is that the police them just had do them job. They were being professional as far as I could have seen. So when you talk about the police do this and the police do that and they are responsible for this and that and how much people them take out and rate and lele, you have to deal with things as it is happening. You can't use the fact of one police or some other incident to fry these police that are doing their job on the spot. You have to deal with things on a case-by-case -case basis. And based on what I am seeing, the popo was not wrong. They were doing their thing and it was very professional. It was refreshing to see the police acting like they are supposed to act all the time. Not some of the time or most of the time. All of the time. Now, we see some people basically verbally abusing the police, calling them this and calling them that. And this one and that one are police officer in them family and Rete and Lele. And the police do this and the police responsible for that. But what stood out most of all is that lady, that last lady that was in the passenger seat of the bus. Now people, when we talk about dark, when we talk about ignorant, when we talk about midnight, that is what she showed because she was trying to show and prove and people, you have to understand how these police are. They know that they are doing their check on camera. So obviously they are not going to act up because obviously they know that they are being recorded so they are going to put their best face forward. But this lady was acting so bad, people, if she did get a little elbow, she would have deserved it and people don't get it twisted. I am not upholding abuse in any sort of the way. Majusa says she was ODing, she was overdoing it. You understand? She was getting carried away. She was abusing these officers. And like me say, what I realize with a lot of Jamaicans, they like to show and prove, especially when they think that they are on camera. And she is claiming that she is going to sue if them search her. Lady, woman, idiot, what are you going to sue them for? You have no case. Because the truth and the fact is that the only thing that you are exhibiting is the fact that you are dark and the fact that you are ignorant and the fact that you need to be tame. Now when we look at that lady, we see that she is wearing a uniform. Now people, I am not sure if it is associated with a school or a job or some sort of employment. But whoever hired her or whichever school that she is attending, they should be very ashamed because she is a disgrace to the uniform. She is a disgrace to women all over the place, specifically in a Jamaica. And she only makes ghetto people look bad because when people from overseas see it, they are going to say all of them Jamaican people are at ghetto and rete and lele. So she is just a bad example, point blank and period. So anyway, people, that is my views on that whole situation. And like I say, it is just my views and opinion. It is not the gospel. Your views and opinion can be respectfully different from mine. But let me know what you think in the comment section. Bless up.